Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the string token function to pass a given string. Suppose I have this string out here that I want to pass and the delimiters that I want to pass this string on are backslash, space and colon. So what I can do is I can write a C program to pass this given string on this delimiters. So I've already written a C program out here. So this is my C program to pass the given string on the given delimiters. So I'll I'll declare a st I'll declare a string st str and string token care. This string will contain the string actual string that I want to pass, and the token care string will contain the tokens that I want to pass this string on. And I'll declare one character pointer and. Uh, what I'll do is, when I run the program, I'll pass the string that I want to pass, pass as a parameter or an argument to the program. So after that, what I'm doing is, I'll copy the first argument to this string from string, and I'll I'll concatenate the blank with the string. Then I'll concatenate the second argument with this the string. Then what I'll do is. I'll copy the tokens on this string copy string then after that I'll call the string token function with two parameters the first parameters is the string that I want to pass and the second parameter is the token delimiters that I want to pass as a string on so when I call this function it will pass the given string and return the passed string so that I'll be storing this point is cptr. After that, I'll just print the cptr. Then I'll repeatedly call this string token function. The one thing to notice out here is when I call the string token function the next time, so instead of str, I'll have to invoke the null out here. So this while loop will get executed repeatedly until the entire until the entire string has been passed. So I'm just passing the string and printing the value of the pass string. So this was the C program to pass a given string on a given delimiters. So let's go ahead and run this program. So I've already compiled this program and the name of my executable is token1. And these are the two and this is the string that I want to pass. So this will be stored in ARGB1, this will be stored in ARGB2. So when I run this program, so the first argument is this one, the second argument is this one, and this everything has been concatenated in this string. So after it has been passed, the first pass string is 30, second is 0, 1, third is 2, 0, 1, 4, and so on and so forth. So this was the C program to pass a given string using f for a given delimiters. So for more on string token function you can use the man command and do str doc to go to the man page for the string token function thanks for watching the video have a nice day